Good morning folks. We're back in for another day of the vlog and uh, yeah I missed a couple of things out yesterday because I got so carried away with the kitchen being operational. So uh, that stuff you've just seen me do at the moment is some of the fittings out of the glass wash and um, well they seem to have attracted quite a little bit of uh, what's it called lime scale for want of a better word I think that's what it is so I've just soaked it in some nitrosid some acid that should get rid of that we've also got a few more packages to unpack this morning we've got a tea urn and a new sack barra for Stuart to enable him to uh, bring the beers from the brewery to the um, pub easier sorry I'm just thinking about the next job which is here so yesterday you would have seen me make this shelving unit which is at the back of this desk there it is so we had a big rat's nest of wires behind here and we basically tidied it all up and I was up trying to upgrade this hard drive on the CCTV unfortunately the 10 terabyte Seagate hard drive that I bought doesn't appear to be compatible so so we've bought an 8 terabyte Western Digital it's got a 2 terabyte Western Digital in at the minute fingers crossed that works but as you can see it's a little bit tidier back there so I just need to clear this clothing off the side we're moving that coat hook as well that's why the clothing's there and then here in the kitchen we have the said 8 terabyte Western Digital hard drive hopefully totally compatible and uh, will work with the CCTV that we've got let's give it a go and I've just found the 10 terabyte one that doesn't seem compatible even though like, the fittings on the end are the same as far as I can tell other end yeah they look the same that looks different but there's no plug for that anyway so yeah I don't know what's going on there and then before I get stuck into this little job because this might take me an hour if it doesn't go right I came up with what was left of that nitrosid and I poured it into the glass wash and I don't know if you can see back there because it's dark but it's totally stripped all of the lime scale off of the element and everything else so hopefully this should be as good as new by the time we start service tonight so we've got the cameras in position the only thing I need to do is adjust that restaurant camera because I think it's chopping people's heads off just there so we'll just re reorientate that a little bit that's much better right the next job is through here folks into the kitchen we've got the two-way hinges on these doors and uh, this is a fire door it's really quite heavy so I'm gonna add another pair in order for it to have a much stronger and sharper response and to hold in place a little bit better when the extractor hood's turned on because it tends to pull the door in a touch so let's get in here have a look what we've got one handed with the my weak hand so here they are got them out of the box and I can safely say that the screws that come with this particular set of hinges throw them in the bin they're no good and change them out for something like these four by thirties they'll do the job way better right I'm gonna have to push this open to expose the screws on the 
door first and then we'll push the other way and expose the screws on the hinge. No, frame. There we go then folks, one, two, three, four, five, six hinges. She works, but I did have to shave a little bit extra off the door. Now she works beautifully and almost, almost stays in the correct position. But I think when the extractor's on that'll be fine. Oh, a couple more jobs done. We've got a fly zapper up on the wall. And around the corner, I'm gonna have to put the first aid kit up on the wall. Just about there, I reckon. What do you think, folks? I reckon that's a good idea. So, SDS, drill holes. Also, the, uh, oh, look how shiny that bad boy is. The acid in there is working an absolute treat. It looks bloody fantastic, doesn't it? Well, let's give it another whirl and let it keep going. Hey! So spitting out at bottom one. So I've been home, folks. I'm not sure where I left off the last clip, but uh, it is now approaching six o'clock. Service has started. I've been home. I've got changed. Me, Gemma, and the kids are going to eat in the restaurant tonight. Why not? He says. So uh, yeah, I'm going to sign out, finish off for today's vlog. Hey, two vlogs in a row. That's not bad going, is it really? Uh, so I'll just show you a couple of clips of whatever's going on in the kitchen now, and uh, maybe I'll pull the camera out whilst we're dining. I don't know. We'll see if it's busy. I won't because uh, I don't want to upset any other any other diners. But yeah, cheers. We'll see you on the next one.